Hi, I am. I'm Mike. Um, I will say my parents do prefer me to say Michael Kelly, but uh, it's Mike. Um, I'm the chairman, the director, the writer, uh, the dame. Uh, I'm not sure there's there's much else I could have taken on. Um, so yeah, that's who I am. And uh, feel free to uh, give me a call sometime. Right. Do you know what? You actually you stood there and I said make it cheesy and you went for it. I know it was hard, but it's something for the kids to enjoy. It's nothing that the audience are gonna go, this is really cheesy. Make it cheesy. And I love it. It's fantastic. High five. Yes. Yes. Excellent. Right, we'll take a break there. <laughs> Stop following me with that camera, damn it! I don't think any of them have ever been involved in a real play before. It's a joke. Why they'd pick this over the Merchant of Venice, I don't know. Hello, my name is Cerise and we're about to do a drama rehearsal. So, yeah, come with me. <laughs> So through this door, we have what we're doing at the moment is people on stage rehearsing the play. So who are you playing today? Um, I'm the narrator, apparently. Interesting. Not really. <laughs> so now we've got our next actor to interview. So who are you? Uh, my name's Alex, and I'm playing Prince Charming. Not today, foul doers! <laughs> Prepare to dance. <laughs> you got that. <laughs> so what does Prince Charming do? He is a bit of a player. He proposes to every princess there is in the play and then ends up falling in love with Cinderella and then realises that she is the one for him. So here we've got Cinderella. So what, do you, what are you doing in this pantomime? Um, well, Cinderella's kind of like the damsel in distress and she feels like she needs a man to come and save her from everything. Hi, I'm Robert. This is my first night here. Don't know what I've let myself in for. <laughs> uh, but I'm having a good time so far. What do you do, Robert? Oh, well, I'm a security guard, it's a day job. No, I mean in the oh, panto. In the panto. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, sorry, oh, I've just uh, played a ghost. I had to write the panto. The show had to really be my own. And of course, why write and direct a panto if you're not going to be in it? So, of course, I'm I'm playing the dame. Uh, Why didn't my wand work? For douche! You may have disowned the name of fairy, but it doesn't mean you're no. You are now mortal. For douche! I I can't be. I'm doing too much if I'm being honest, but uh, well, it'll all be worth it in the end. Don't, don't hurt me! It's okay. I'm sorry, I'm just hamming it up now. I I really want that Oscar. I mean, I have a fantastic cast. Uh, um, I mean, yeah, sure, my narrator's hell bent on doing Shakespeare throughout the panto, but uh, I'm sure he can be controlled. My cast, they are, as I said, they are fantastic. I don't want them to think that I'm some sort of uh, mad person hell bent on making this the most brilliant panto on the planet. I mean, uh, get back to work! <laughs>